As part of measures aimed at cushioning the effect of fuel subsidy removal by the federal government, Governor Sheriff Oberwori has rolled out palliatives for the 50,996 workers in the state public service. Governor Oberwori made this statement at the inauguration of 26 commissioners into the state executive council at the event center, Sabah. He said that some of 10 billion naira will be paid, 10,000 naira will be paid to the 50,000 196 workers in the state public service for the next three months, starting from August. Our Sabah correspondent, Apume Jero Friday, reports that Governor Oberivori added that the staff figure included employees of the 10 higher institutions in the state. The governor disclosed that an approval has been given for workers on salary grade levels 1 to 14 should run shifts from Monday to Wednesday as first batch, while second batch would be from Thursday to Friday. Keeping faith with the electorate to make life richer and more fulfilling for them as contained in the more agenda. Consistent with my pledge to be governor for all, I have constituted a committee headed by the SSG and other stakeholders, including labor, to work out palliatives that will cover the following segments of the population population, namely people living with disabilities, widows, poor and vulnerable households that do not belong to the above categories, and the aged. I expect us to roll out palliatives for these categories of people as soon as the committee submits its report. However, the governor noted that working remotely was also uh, the judiciary and legislature were to wish to reiterate the point I made to special advisors on the need for elected officials and political appointees to be our brother's keeper, given the prevailing economic hardship in the country. Our people are going through very difficult times. Therefore, those of us that have the privilege of public office must do everything within our powers to bring relief to the poor and the less privileged. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.